In the previous lesson, we built a multimodal chat that can analyze images. Now let's add PDF support. If our AI can read and understand PDF documents, users can ask questions, get summaries, or extract specific information without reading through dozens of pages. Super useful feature and super easy to implement with the AI SDK. Let's start with the route handler. Remember when we added image support, we didn't have to write any additional code. Same story for PDFs. Our multimodal chat route handler already handles PDFs because the AI SDK automatically takes care of processing them. All we need to do is update our UI to display PDFs in the chat. So let's do that. Open the multimodal chat page.tsx file and find the switch statement where we handle message parts. We've got cases for text and file types. For the file case, right now, we are checking if it's an image, and if it is, we render it using the image component. If it's not an image, we return null. But we want to handle PDFs too. So right after the image if block, let's add another check for PDFs. dot starts with application slash PDF. PDFs have a media type that starts with application slash PDF. So we check for that just like we did for images. Inside this if block, we need to render the PDF. Now for PDFs, we will use an iframe. Browsers have built in PDF viewers. So an iframe works perfectly for displaying PDFs. Now let's add the attributes. First, the key for React. So key is equal to dollar curly braces message.id followed by the index, so dollar curly braces index, then the source URL, so source is equal to part URL, and this is the URL where the PDF is hosted. Same pattern as images. Then let's set the dimensions. Width is equal to 500, and height is equal to 600. Feel free to style the iframe as you see fit. Finally, add a title for accessibility. So title, if part dot file name exists, render that. Otherwise, attachment followed by index. That's it. The file case now handles both images and PDFs. Let's test this. In the browser, navigate to slash UI slash multimodal chat and click attach files. But this time, select a PDF file. Could be anything, a report, documentation, flight tickets, whatever PDF you have. I have attached the landing page for AI SDK docs as my attachment. The text now reads one file attached. In the input, type something like, what's this document about? Or summarize the main points and hit enter. I had to reset the zoom to accommodate this iframe, but you can see the PDF is rendered in your chat our prompt, what's this document about? And we get the AI response. This document provides an overview of the AI SDK by Vercel, a TypeScript toolkit designed to help developers build AI powered applications across various frameworks and providers. You can try asking specific questions. What does page two talk about? The AI reads through the PDF and gives you the appropriate answers. You can see the AI respond to page two discusses the supported AI model providers integrated with the AI SDK. With PDF support, you can build all sorts of document analysis tools, contract review systems where users upload agreements and ask about specific clauses, research assistants that help parse through academic papers, documentation Q&A bots for technical manuals and more. The same file attachment flow works for both images and PDFs. Users can even attach multiple files, mix images and PDFs in one message if they want to. The AI processes everything and each file renders correctly in the chat. So now we have a multimodal chat that handles text, images, and PDFs.